Alright, hi, welcome back to GeoGuessa. You will notice my rating is uh, up around 997. No move is 995. I'm gonna keep playing no move. And uh, if we win, I think that means we'll go up above 1000, which is a fun, arbitrary milestone. Uh, I still don't really understand how the, how the GeoGuessa ELO system works, but, you know. Um, four digits seems like an, uh, a fun achievement, so we'll go for that today. Uh, it's entirely possible we will lose, which is also fine. Like, uh, you know, I just like playing the game, man. It's good. It's a good time. I, uh, learn stuff. It's fun. And, uh, sometimes my mistakes are honestly the most entertaining part. Greetings to you, my Brazilian friend. Okay. Round one. This appears European to me. The concrete road is interesting. Yeah, we got blue strips. Okay. What is this crop, do we think? It seems kind of corn adjacent. That doesn't really help me out. We got- are these poppies? Is this Belgium? I was just looking at Belgium. And down. Um, I think they have concrete roads more than other Western European countries, so I might just go for it. Northern Belgium, because it's kind of flat. Like up here somewhere. We'll try that out, shall we? Hello. I like your Volkswagen. Uh, and your cornfield. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, it was Belgium. Where did you go? Denmark. Okay. Not a bad guess. I, yeah. Had I not been just looking at Belgium, I probably would have... Denmark is, is totally reasonable as well. Um, this is... Okay, what side of the road are we driving on? We're driving on the right, so it's Taiwan. Um, I literally str have struggled so much with telling the difference between Hong Kong and Taiwan. And there's such an easy way to tell the difference. You just look at what side of the road you're on. But uh, I didn't used to do that. I would just panic and click the wrong one. <laughs> I don't know if this is Taipei, but it's kind of built up, so we'll try it out. Oh, it's Pengu. I didn't know there was a city that big in Pengu. Yeah, I guess there is. That's cool. Okay. Alright. Um... Brazil? No. Yeah, I was gonna say the camera quality is wrong for Brazil. But the, it just looks a bit Brazilian, doesn't it? With the red dirt and that. Now, where's the red dirt in... Uh, Nigeria. I don't really know. We're gonna go kind of Kadunari region, I think. Okay, it was just Abuja, but that's fine. Uh, we're a little bit closer. Very nice, into round four. Uh, what do you say? Okay. Are you a... no, okay. Tubak win? Is this Wales? What is that? What are these? The Snowdonia? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Wait, it's South Africa. Wait, is it? Wait. Okay. Calm down. Have a look around. Where's the sun? The sun is north. So it's not Snowdonia, it's probably, well, look at the poles. Look at the poles. They're not very helpful, but that's okay. Wait, are you helpful? Are you a Western Cape pole? I wouldn't be surprised if this is Western Cape. Wow, okay. Uh, you saw nothing, we didn't nearly go Wales on Cape Town, it's fine. It's so fine. Don't even worry about it. I don't know what this is. That really confused me. And the Gen 2. I was like, this is the UK. But no. Uh, unless it is. It's not. It's just okay. Yep. Okay. It's fine. See? It's fine. <laughs> Nothing happened. Sometimes, sometimes you have to spend a little, a little bit of time on a round to, you know, actually observe all the information and then make an informed decision 
instead of just seeing a vaguely <laughs> vaguely Welsh looking uh, thing and okay red reflectors uh, is that Spain maybe are those blue strips on both sides because it's be Italy I don't actually know my reflectors I know they're yellow in Andorra I'm doing I'm studying Europe alphabetically so I've done <laughs> Andorra and Austria and I'm on Belgium so Spain is a, a little further down my list. I'm not really there yet, but I think that's a possibility for this. Uh, or Italy. Spain or Italy, right? I think there's a... Decent guesses. What's this blue sign? I think you kind of get those all over the place. We got pine trees. Eh. I mean, do we go France just to split the difference? I, you know, I don't know, I think I go Italy, I think it's a little not dry enough, if that makes sense, yo, okay, yeah, I mean, totally fair, I was a bit, I was tempted to do that on the other side of Italy, but we somehow make a very decent guess. I'll take I'll take that. Yeah, it just looked like kinda looked like an Italian plate. I honestly couldn't tell. Um wind turbines church. Okay, it's Europe. Is it Dutch? It's kinda hills though, so like no. So maybe it's Danish. Maybe just German? We go like Bremen-ish. Okay, it was just German, but the wrong side. That's fine. Uh, still decent points. We're actually doing some good damage here. Round 7. 2.5 times. Okay. Oh, we have a car. We have a car of interest. What is that blob? Is that Puerto Rico? <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think that's the Panama flag. I don't want a Panama incident again. I'm just gonna click Panama City. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um, there's a there's a video on my channel that's like an hour long of me just playing Jules and there is a there is a pretty significant Panama related incident in that video. This is Albania. Uh, so if you want to see me suffer, you can um, go watch that. <laughs> but yeah, it's it's due to like terrible mistakes like that that mean I'm never missing that country again. You know, you gotta make those mistakes in order to learn and have it stick in your brain. This is the most Albanian location I've ever seen, but I couldn't really tell you where. Uh, where are the mountains? Kind of north and kind of south. I mean. Yeah, like, do we have a church or something that might help me out? No, just Tirana then, I suppose. Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> it wasn't Tirana, but it was close enough. Um... Okay. Uh, Japan? Maybe? Is this Lorcan? I can never tell. Is it? Wait. What is this pole? We got a guy wire. I don't know those, but I know that Japan has those, so it's very flat. Is this rice? I don't think so. I might go slightly north of Tokyo. I'm still not 100% sure that it's Japan. Uh, just slightly north of Tokyo. Okay, it was. It was Hokkaido. GG's, I suppose. Um, 
That was Hokkaido? What did I miss there? Hokkaido, I feel like, is always very obvious. Uh, Alright, let's have a quick look. So, Belgium we got, that was quite nice. Uh, Taiwan was Penku County, which apparently has a giant city that I was unaware of. Nigeria was fine. Cape Town was almost Wales, but it's fine. That was very lucky. That was kinda lucky. Uh, Panama was fine. Albania, that was just the most Albanian location I've ever seen in my entire life. That was like, yeah, a lot of clues. Um, water tanks on the roof, the street signs for Albanian, the like red roofs, like all that stuff. Um, what happened? You went South Korea. Okay, well, fair enough, because they're actually, yeah, that was actually pretty tough. I'm just trying to, was there anything Hokkaido-y? I know that there's a lot of, oh, are these Hokkaido cabbages maybe off in the distance? Yeah, actually, they totally are. I just wasn't really looking for them. Um, oh yeah, they're like everywhere. <laughs> okay, well. Uh, look at the vegetation, is always a lesson, um, can be very useful. I was looking more for like infrastructure kind of stuff, uh, which is also useful, but you know, sometimes plants can help you out a lot. Uh, yeah, but, well, let's have a look at, uh, let's have a look at the main menu. I would imagine, yeah, 10, 12. 10, 10 for no move. Moving's way down at 770, but I just, I'm, I'm on a laptop, which is already a disadvantage. I'm on Australian internet, uh, and I try to record these, which just means that my game is very slow and makes moving quite frustrating. So I do love moving as a gamer, but on my current setup, it's, it's not the best. So I've been enjoying no move. I think I'll stick with it. Um, I'll see if I can, I don't know, I might invest in your computer, guys. I don't know if that's... <sighs> I, can't, I mean, this is a pretty old laptop at this point. We'll see. We'll think about it. We'll think about it. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. That was a fun jewel.